in, in my heart and in my mind. Give us a wave. <laughs> Yeah. And a dog. Look at the little doggy. Yeah. This is an old road bridge right next to the lock here at Young's Point and there used to be a plaque down at the end i think it's still there i'm just not sure if it's still legible but i believe this is the oldest or first uh iron bridge of its type built in canada ontario the world i don't know <laughs> we're in, i'm gonna go look and see what it's all about but it's a pretty cool sight especially when the sun is out shining because you have a nice view i'm gonna just swing this around overlooking the uh, road bridge with all that water coming out. And again, there is a big flow of water, heavy flow of water throughout the system still, even though most of the rain is behind us. But it's also pretty to look over the uh, water control dam, which is immediately, immediately beside the lock, which is located right there. Yeah, lots of water still flowing. Still trying to clear out the system. So here we are. Is This plaque is still here. Uh, just very quickly, Young's Point Bridge was built by the Dominion Bridge Company and one of the oldest bridges on the Trent Severn Waterway. Wrought iron is its uh, building thing. So just a little neat piece of history. And of course this was 1884, so almost 140-ish uh, years ago. 30, something like that, before they replace it with the uh, real road bridge over there now. See a little guy? Big boy. That's, that's a big doggy. Wow. Marmaduke. So we just wandered over. There is, this is called the Old Bridge Inn. I'm sure there's a little bit of history to it, given the fact that it's right next to the Old Bridge. And I'm sure it's still an inn. And um, they are saying that they are fully booked for tonight. Reservations required. So I'm going to give them a shout. Maybe we can get in here tomorrow night because we are going to spend another night here in Young's Point. And then, uh, yeah, license. Here we are, the Old Bridge Inn. What does the sign say? It says traditional bed and breakfast, licensed dining, Riverside patio. Patio would be nice, but tomorrow's supposed to be raining. And as you can see, it's conveniently located right next to the old bridge. Anchor Girl and I are just doing some wandering around. This is day three here at Young's Point, at staying at um, the Island View Inn and Resort and Marina. It's not an inn, it's a resort marina. And uh, just talking to the marina operator again this morning, Keith, if you ever drop by and if you're just sliding by drop in say hi say hi to Keith and tell him that you know anchor girl and oh man that'll give you points for sure but anyways we are going um, we're just do, doing a little walk around uh, we are spending like I said this is our third day here we're gonna be spending tomorrow night as well tomorrow day and night because this is a long weekend here in Ontario area Canada and everywhere else is pretty much booked and irrespective of the weather uh, the locks will probably be busy because it is, you know, it's one of the long weekends of the summer. And so everything's going to be busy, especially through the Kawartha areas. So we just felt we better off. We have short power, we're tied up. And rather than, you know, desperately looking for, not desperately, but, you know, searching and looking for another place to spend tonight and tomorrow, especially given the fact that it's supposed to rain this afternoon, and rain and thunderstorms tomorrow. Um, Keith was good enough to let us stay for a couple of extra days, which is what we're going to do, and go out for dinner probably tomorrow night over at this place. And in the meantime, we'll just uh, take advantage of some downtime and not having a travel time, and you'll be happy to know, of course, this is going to be way after the fact, but I did edit and upload another video yesterday. That's two so far, and I'm supposed to be on holidays. <laughs> so with the rain coming tomorrow, 
I might put one more together for you guys. So but by the time you see this, you've already seen that. So whatever. Making the most of it. Not raining. Still a beautiful day. Oh, there's Anchor Girl. I may have mentioned this before, but I'm just going to say it again. It's so it's just pointing out to Anchor Girl once again with all this rain and everything that we've been having all summer um, the trees the greenery is so full and so bright and so lush it's it's awesome if you look back in my uh, videos my Georgian Bay playlist you'll find a video when we were up there in 2012 and we actually stayed on a, a mooring ball and I remember coming into our anchorage at Port Ross and Bay on beautiful, gorgeous bay. That it was, uh, it looked like fall, looked like late fall because the trees, it was so dry that summer and all the trees were yellow and dying and dried out, clearly. Whereas here, got the opposite. And the trees are all happy, happy, happy. And surprisingly, not too, too many bugs. You would think there would be a lot of bugs with all this, but. Uh, Nothing more than normal. I'd say actually less. That's just a shot looking back from the dam back to where we're moored. You can just see the dinghy on Boogaboo sticking out. That is Island View Marina. Sorry, Island View Resort and Marina, you know that. I'm just standing over here on the water control dam right beside the uh, lock. Just another view of the lock here, Young's Point Lock 27 from the uh, opposite side. Uh, that is the lock side trading company store that we were in yesterday briefly. Well, briefly, took a wand around. Look at the shirts and stuff like that. And this is the top side of the lock. It's a couple of bigger ones. I don't know if they're coming in because uh, there was a 400 C ray just pulled onto the wall. So I'm guessing uh, his buddy behind him is going to pull onto the gray wall as well. Running around like a spazoid. Just you be careful you don't run right outside and splash in the river. Okay, you want to go inside? Come on. Come on. Mr. Crazy. Here you go. Go on. If you're going, go on. Oh no, Daddy. Now I'm stuck inside. Hi guys, I come to you from inside Boogaboo, where we are still here at Island View Resort Marina. This is day five for us. Oh man, can you believe it? As I mentioned before, the weather is uh, really has, the weather hasn't been the greatest. So we're glad that we had a place to spend the night. And the reason I'm coming to you from inside the boat right now is because we are immediately beside the restaurant and the restaurant puts on their music at about 11 o'clock in the morning, goes to about nine o'clock. So there's great tunes playing in the background, but of course it's going to be a copyright flag for me from YouTube if I, uh, if I record out there. Yeah, I just want to wrap up by saying that uh, great time. Always, always inspiring to come back here to see Keith and his family at Island View. Again, if you have a chance, if even if you're just, if you're driving by, come in, stop in, say hi, tell them the Boogaboo crew sent you, and uh, they would love to hear that. And if you get a chance, spend a night, maybe two, if nothing else, maybe hit the restaurant. The restaurant is open, and yes, again, we did five nights at the restaurant. It's okay. I eat healthy every night. Uh, salad, they get an awesome chef salad with whatever you want on it. It was really, really good filling and good for me too. Yeah, so I'm going to leave it at that. Um, I will see you tomorrow.
my real time will be tomorrow as we depart here in the morning we will do our uh, pump out of course top up with fuel water and uh, we'll be on our way and like I said it's supposed to be a nice sunny day so I hope to get a lot of footage I'll please to let you know if you can see the laptop down here but I edited another video this afternoon just uh, compressing a little bit so I can upload it and uh, yeah that's three videos now that I've done while we're on holidays okay guys appreciate that <laughs> and also I want to say finally and then I'll let you go on this one is um, it's great to see everybody that we do on the way everywhere we stop everywhere we stop people come up to us and like hey anchor girl and hey boogaboo uh, watch all your videos it's awesome so that's good and you know some folks are good enough to uh, spend a few minutes with us talk especially if they're boaters we talk about boats boating and their experiences themselves and uh, the fact that they love to watch my videos and which I really really appreciate hearing from you guys on that so thanks to all of you you know who you are <laughs> and I'll leave it at that as well and we will see you guys all down the road and I'll see you tomorrow in my world that's it for for now from Island View Resort and Marina and we will see you on the next one cheers